Hello, it's Unchained Skid with you again. We'll tell you a little bit of story of uh, something that happened to me along one of my road trips here that maybe can help you out. As I was going along, I got a little warning light. Now I'm gonna look at the dash here. We'll just turn on the power. Now you can't see the warning light. I'll draw it in there a little bit later, but because it happened right up in here. So it appeared right up in here. And I'm looking at myself going, oh no, what's going on? So the first thing I do is I get out my handy dandy manual and the manual says for warning lamps and indicators pages go to page 96 okay so I go to page 96 and that's where it starts and I start looking through and I see the wrench and I say oh, okay well what does the wrench mean and the wrench says if it illuminates when the engine is running, this indicates a malfunction. Oh man, drive in a moderate fashion, etc., etc. Switch the engine off, attempt to restart, and have your vehicle checked as soon as possible. Now I'm in the middle of a big trip when this is going on with the trailer and everything. I'm going, oh no. Well, what about that other symbol that's underneath it? Well, that's this one. And this one says, if it illuminates, when the engine is running, indicates a malfunction. Stop your vehicle and check the engine oil level, which I did. And the engine oil level was fine. And I'm like, yikes, I might have to get this thing in right away and, uh, and get it looked at. I managed to limp. I was going to Kamloops at the time. I limped as far as Kamloops. And I talked to some of the guys there. And some of the guys there are going, uh, are you sure that wasn't your change oil light? I'm like, where's the change oil light? So I look for it in here. And in this stupid manual, the way it's written, because I'm a pilot, I just go to the checklist, right? And this manual is written very poorly, so that you could look, say, and say, well, where are the different displays at? And you can say, okay, well, maybe I should have been looking in A, because that's where it was. It says information displays, page 100. Okay, but page 100 doesn't say jack <laughs> Although, if you go over to information displays here, Kevin, there is a message that says, Oil change required. Displays when the engine oil life is depleted and your vehicle requires an oil change. Maybe that's it, except you will notice there's no symbol here. It's just written out that way. So how are you supposed to tell? Now, just for information, let's turn the dash on again, put some power. If you look over towards the tack, that's where the symbol is supposed to show up. So what they were talking about, about what I was just saying, that's the little oil light there. There's an engine light and then there would be a little wrench there if I needed the maintenance. Not there, but there. So what that light really meant, maybe you think I'm dumb because I didn't know, but I didn't know. I'm just looking it up in the manual. That means it needs an oil change. Well, my oil was just changed, so it just means that my mechanic didn't reset the light. Well, how do you reset the light? I just looked it up on the internet, but it turns out it's actually in the manual here too. If you jump way down to the maintenance section on page 238, it says, Oil change indicator reset. Only reset the system after changing the oil. Yeah, duh. Switch the engine, switch the ignition on. Now pay attention here. This is how you do this. Switch the ignition on. Do not start the engine. Fully press the accelerator and brake pedals at the same time. Keep them fully pressed. After three seconds, a message appears confirming that the reset is in progress. After 25 seconds, a message appears confirming the reset is complete. Release the accelerator and brake pedal, switch the engine off. Guess what happened after I did that? The symbol went away, because that's what it was. It was the symbol for changing the oil. So here I am, 300 kilometers away from where I want to be, thinking that my engine's about to cave on me, when really all it was is that my mechanic just didn't uh, flip the switch on the, uh, or press the accelerator and the brake to reset the oil indicator. So for those of you guys who come up and uh, you see that little symbol come up on your, uh, on the main information display on your dash, if the wrench is right beside the oil can and it's on the main display in the middle, it means that all you do is need an oil change or that the indicator wasn't reset. Do it, uh, the, just reset it the way I just said. It doesn't mean your engine's about to cab.
can't say how much I loathe the way this manual has been written. Anyway, I hope that helps somebody out there. Keep that in mind doing your uh, van life stuff. All right, we'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs>